Hey guys, welcome back. Today I want to make a quick video to show you a problem that may occur on your yard works or MTD blower with the power more engine. On some of the new engines, pressure may build up in the crankcase and it'll make the front PTO seal on the crankshaft pop off. Now the reason this is happening is the tube here sometimes, depending on where you live, will get clogged up with ice and the pressure from the engine cannot escape. So it creates pressure in the crankcase. And that's why the seal will pop off. Now, if this happens to you, you will end up with oil on the belts and you may have some oil on the drive discs inside the transmission. If that happens to you, you can reinsert the seal in there, which I will show you how to do. Also, what you'll have to do is grab some brake cleaner and just go clean all the oil that got on the drive parts here and the belts if they're oily. Put it back together, it's going to be fine. Now MTD is aware of this and they will send you a shield. It is part number 751P19088. And once you get this shield, what you do is you just install it over here and bolt it on the three bolts. It is very, very easy to do. And in most cases, this seal is very reusable unless it got damaged. And to access the seal, you will have to remove the 916 bolt that holds the pulleys on the shaft first, as you see here. So to get that seal in, just get it back on the crankshaft. And what you want to do is push it in evenly. Now push it in as much as you can with your fingers first. Now I'm using a 5 16 pin punch. And I will put it in evenly. So go in a diagonal fashion here. And once you have it in, as I mentioned, just clean all the other moving parts in the transmission and you'll be good to go. And again, don't forget to call MTD about this because it may be covered under warranty and they will send you that plate like I showed you guys. Now, after I had the machine all together, I went to try it out and the belts were slipping. They were just so impregnated with oil that there was no way to clean them. So I did end up putting on two new belts. And what I've done is put the link below the video here for you to watch the complete belt replacement on a similar machine. And last but not least guys, make sure to check the oil level and add some oil if necessary. Thanks for watching and have a good day.